So we're sitting north, we look around, still a lot of stripers around, we catch a couple more, but we know there's that big biomass with the whales to the south. So the guys head that direction. The whales are still putting on a show, there's still sand eels in the water, the wind has died down, it's flat calm. The humpbacks do what you call bubble netting, where you can see them going in a circle with bubbles, the bubbles come to the surface, and the whales come right up in between it. And they're doing it 10 yards from our boat. When the humpbacks make their way through the bubble nets, they open their mouth and take in everything they can and push the water through as many as 800 baleen bristles. I love seeing it. I think anytime you can be out on the water, that's part of being a fisherman, that's part of being an angler, is enjoying and seeing things like that. Ooh, wow. Oh my God, that is awesome. That is pretty sick, dude. Dude, that is incredible. Look at that. Nothing. Pretty slow today with this flat water here. Unfortunately, this time of year during the migration here, you know, it's always transitional and so, Nothing to hang our hat on today. We're in the hunt mode. All I'm seeing everywhere I look is just school after school is striped bass. So just looking around, there's a bunch of whales, tons of bait in the water. You can see all the sand eels in the water. And we're looking around best we can to try to find some tuna, see if they pop up. A lot of life in the area. If they're here, just gotta find them. We're looking at a whole lot of life. So me and Adrian go to the bow, and we're casting. I have my lure out of the water. He's still bringing his back right next to the boat. He looks down, sees a monster fish. Look at this one. <laughs> Sick. It's awesome. Great strike, comes right up to it, inhales his stick bait. That's a big one. That's a big, big one. <laughs> that was sick. That was sick, dude. He said, look at oh, it. Oh, look at him, that's sick. That's a big bass Whoa. right there. Oh, absolutely. This is the biggest striper I've ever got. A uh, big striped bass. Actually, cool, really, really cool visual hit. Came right up to the boat, and uh, I called it out before it actually ate the lure. Nice retrieve, nice fish. Thank Beautiful you, striper, sir. man. Way to go, buddy. Awesome fish, yeah, man. Trophy size striper, Cape Cod. Probably the biggest stripers in the world. Awesome. Can't beat it. I smell a little lemon, garlic, olive oil, and a grill here coming soon. <laughs>